More children, more elderly, and more young adults in Youngstown are living in poverty. That's according to a new study released by the state of Ohio. Investigative reporter Amanda Smith breaks down those numbers. Lauren, this new study discovered that the percentage of people living in poverty in the Youngstown area increased from 24% to almost 40%. Now that happened in just 15 years. And people who work in social services say there's no end in sight to the increase. The state of Ohio study says 23,000 people in Youngstown make less than the federal poverty limit. That's about $1,000 a month for a single person or $2,000 a month for a family of four. Now that number is before taxes. After payroll deductions, people have even less to pay their bills or buy food. Michael Iberis is with the Second Harvest Food Bank. Last year, the charity distributed 10.5 million pounds of food. That's the most ever. We see the, the, the need increasing, so our, our goal is to go out and find more food to bring into the area so we can get it out to people in need. All throughout the community, volunteers and social organizations come together to fight against the effects of poverty. But the increasing rate is making it more and more difficult for these groups to do their jobs. Now that means programs have had to change, from large grants that help homeless students to small food pantries. Now tonight on First News at 5 and 6, I'll introduce you to a woman who's been feeding the hungry for 30 years. And I'll tell you about all the challenges that she's had to face in that time. Reporting in the studio, Amanda Smith, 27 Investigates.